Hey everyone, what's up and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Gab. And I thought because, you know, it's April, it's springtime, uh, Easter also falls sometimes in March, but this year April. So I figured I would try out some like April-y spring products with you guys. I'm really excited for the one. I think I'm going to hate it, but we will see what happens. Uh, I don't normally do food testing videos. I mostly do like mukbangs. So if you guys like this video, please thumbs it up and subscribe down below. Become a Barbie or a Ken, but I'm pretty sure you already knew that. So let me get into this one with you guys. So this is a Pepsi Peeps. So it's a Peeps X Pepsi sort of, you know, crossover. And I'm quite scared for it because I know in the past there's been drinks like this out and I've tried them and I've hated them. I hate that they taste like marshmallow-y. I love marshmallow, don't get me wrong, but with soda, just too sweet, too sugary for me in the past. But we'll see what I think of this one. And uh, I love Peeps, they're adorable. So let's just admire the can for a minute too. Isn't that adorable? Like all the little uh, Peeps indentations on it. And I think it's really cute. So, oh gosh, I'm so nervous. Because if I don't like it, that's weird. It has like a carbonated smell, but also it smells like I just heated up a peep in my microwave. Oh, it's weird. It smells like Pepsi, but then there's just like a hint of peep. I know it sounds weird, but that's what it is. Oh my god, there's a huge fucking wasp outside my window. Anyways. ADHD brain, but that was massive. That's how you know it's spring. <laughs> All right, let's do this. It's not terrible, but I don't love it. It has a really weird after flavor of like peep. Does that make sense? Like, like when you're eating it in your mouth, like that sugary texture that's on the outside, like that's what it tastes like, but in like a soda. It's so odd. I would suggest you try one for yourself if you can. Uh, this isn't like a regular size, I don't believe. This is like a smaller size of it. Uh, it's just not hitting, not hitting the way that I thought it would, that I would like it. <laughs> um, but nonetheless, at least I tried it, right? Our second product is from a chocolate company called Gertrude Hoff, if you guys have ever heard of it. And I'm pretty excited for this one because I have a dinosaur egg here. Yes. So it has little chocolate dinosaurs on the inside of it. And I am really freaking excited to try this with you guys and to open it. Uh, I'm guessing that... I don't know how to open this like properly because of this tag, but I'm guessing we're gonna have to like smash the egg open to get the chocolate. Kind of like a hollow Easter bunny. Or no, I think it's opened already. I think it's cracked already. I'm not really sure. Let's let's dive into this one together. Cause that was my thing. I'm like, do we just smack it open? How does this work? Let's take it out of the box. The box is so cute, like I said. Very prehistoric looking. And then I love it has these to keep it fresh. Oh, oh my goodness. Okay, look guys. Here's the egg. And then it's in two pieces. So it's hollow. And then the little dinosaurs are in the inside of it. And I thought they were more like 3D and not flat, but they're flat. So this is interesting. I was kind of excited to like crack it open. Mm. Like I said, if the egg was closed, bonus points, but this is so good. All right. I think this is the part that everybody's waiting for. I know it's all the same. It tastes all the same, but the shell part. Mm. Good. So those are just a few Eastery things I wanted to show you. 
Uh, I don't really celebrate Easter too much, but the Pepsi and the dinosaur, I, I couldn't help but do. So I hope you guys liked it. And if you did, please thumbs it up and let me know in the comments down below. And I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye, guys.